I am so, 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 so excited. It's moving day! Welcome to my moving vlog. I don't know if this is gonna be like one vlog just of clips of the whole week or I'm just gonna film separate parts. We're just gonna see what happens. I'll see how long these come out, but ah! I feel like I've kept this so hush hush on my channel. And it's just because of COVID 19, we had a lot of obstacles for ages. We genuinely were not sure whether all of this was just gonna fall through or not. Thankfully, we're in the position now where it's happening, the mortgage was accepted, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I think me and Will are gonna film just like a sit down talky video about our whole experience and everything, so. But today is a moving day. So, I thought I'd just show you guys where we're up to. It is 9.57. Oh, so for anyone who's moved before or you already know about this stuff, but basically on the day you move, you have to wait for like the money to all go through. So we're picking up the keys from the solicitor once the money has all gone through. So that's what we're waiting for right now. We don't know when it will be. We're quite lucky that there's no rush. The house we're moving into is empty. We haven't like hired anyone to come with a van and help us move since like we don't have a ton of stuff. We just rented here. Yeah, so not too much pressure, but anyway. So this is the current situation in the flat. We have pretty much packed almost everything up. We've hired a van and we're just gonna pack it up probably quite soon. So yeah, Will's getting ready. Um, I should probably do some cleaning and then we'll maybe start packing. I'm gonna take you guys along with us for the whole journey. I don't do vlogs very often, but I knew I definitely wanted to sort of document this because me, when I knew we were gonna be moving, I watched so many of these vlogs and I was like, yeah, it's just nice to see what it's like. And plus it'll just be a nice memory to look back on. Yeah, I'll keep you posted. Guys, so classic me receiving a parcel even on the day we're moving, but this one is pretty exciting. Basically, for these moving vlogs, I wanted to buy a wide angle lens. I mean, also just because I think they look really cool with videos anyway. For those of you who are into like photography, filmography, I got um, the Canon 10 to 18 millimeter lens um, and I was a bit dumb, I didn't do my research. And I didn't know that it needs an adapter to go on my Canon EOS M50. So that's what arrived today. So here we go, a little unboxing. I mean, it's kind of perfect timing since this is the start of the moving box. So if this works, hopefully it'll switch to wide angle lens. Here it is. Anyway, I'm gonna try this out. Fingers crossed the next clip you see is a wide angle shot in focus. Pray for me. <laughs> It worked! Oh my god, yes! I'm actually so, so happy. Quick little outfit of the day. Joggers from ASOS, these are in a haul of mine. This is just a little crop top from Topshop, bralette from Holster, and then this is a cord shirt from Nasty Gal. So good. <gasps> Will's coming back because he just parked the van, so I'm gonna get his impression. Uh, Guess what arrived? Oh yeah. It looks so cool. I look so open. It works so well. I'm so happy. Did we get a ticket, by the way? No. We didn't get a, a ticket for, for the van because we may have not paid for parking this morning. Anyway, yeah, do you I like it? Tell them. Are you excited to move? No. <laughs> no. Yeah. I am excited. It's, I'm uh, so excited, but right now it's like the weird period where we just have to wait. Yeah. Until the solicitor says we're good to go. It's just clean, pack, get stuff uh, tied over this end because. There's nothing else we can do. Anyway, yeah, I'll fill you guys in. I'm gonna miss the flat. It is a really nice flat. Um, oh. But he's got an email. He's got an email. Oh, that's my phone. That's yours as well. Uh, uh, it's our solicitor and that we are now settled. I didn't even come with the keys. <laughs> that's not bad. It's only. Yeah, 1053. What do you want to do? Pack the van first or go collect keys? We'll Get the keys. keys. They accepted us! We are now homeowners! Oh man, homeowners are so weird, yeah. It's so odd. I've been waiting so long for this moment. I've run out of stuff to say now. We're gonna go get the keys.
the reveal, the unboxing. Yeah, I was say the unboxing. There it is. Oh, I love this thing. It's like a million pairs of keys. Don't know what it's for. That's so cool. Black adults. Black adults. Here's where the estate agents. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Step one, get the keys. Complete. Now back to the flat. Now for the hard part. Yeah, the packing. So we've just packed up the van. There's a few bits and bobs left to pack up, but oh my god, I'm sweating and I absolutely stink. Look how sad though. So empty. Say bye, flat. Bye, flat. I'm quite sad now. I know, it looks so empty. Yeah. Bad of good memories. Lots of good memories. Yeah, we're actually gonna come back tomorrow and clean. So. It's not farewell, farewell. To the van? Well, you're gonna drive the van. To the move mobile. I'm gonna drive our little car. Mm -hmm. I'll follow you. Oh, here we go. like our original reaction because Will made a good point that we should just take it in with our eyes but oh my god we're in the house and it honestly has exceeded my expectations we literally arrived like 10 minutes ago just walked around checked everything because this sounds stupid but we weren't even sure like what was going to be left oh so far everything is perfect oh my gosh the thing that I was so happy about was that it comes with a dishwasher. Ah, me and Will were so worried about this, but there's a washing machine. We were not expecting that. Here, yeah, feeling very, very lucky. And if you're wondering where Will is. Hello. <laughs> this is his bedroom. This is my bedroom. Harry Potter style. <laughs> what do you think? Ah, uh, I'm overstimulated. I can't, it's so, there's so much like, happening in my brain. I've yeah. got a headache, I'm really tired. I'm dehydrated, we're I'm hungry. I'm starving, but um, I'm delighted. I yeah. didn't get many clips of us like actually packing up the van because it was exhausting, it was boring, and I tried to get one clip and Will was like, Woo! with the pivot. Oh, I'm just buzzing. <sighs> and like the electricity and stuff's working as well. Yeah, we the have water, running water. <laughs> the water's working. Um, I think we have the utilities to set up like stupid stuff like Wi-Fi and... Maybe, that's like the biggest yeah. worry. Well, yeah, because I'm that. hoping I can still work from home. <laughs> uh, and yourself, always fun. But, uh... Get this out. Yeah, yeah. should be fine. Uh, I'm just gonna unload that bloody van. Yeah, yeah. that's not gonna be fun, but... but it'll be right. Um, it's in such a cute little neighborhood as well. Like, I have never lived in a house. You have. Mm -hmm. I've always been in flats. Say hi! Oh hi! Yeah, sorry, I think my camera cut me off in the last clip, but yeah, it's so exciting. I've never been in a house. I've never had, like, stairs. Ah! Never had a dishwasher. It's just so exciting. That's why it's, it's emotional, because I feel unbelievably grateful. Walking downtown and I'm okay. Finished. <laughs> I'm tired. I look disgusting. I'm sorry. Will has just started being a babe and popping some of our stuff into the wardrobe. Falls went into a mirrored closet, so very cool. Um, and honestly, we're starving. Like, very, very hungry, so we're gonna go buy food and also buy bits and bobs, aren't we? We're gonna try to buy like a microwave and other Kettle. essentials. Get Kettle. the brew going. Because we're British and we like our tea. Yeah. But, yeah, feeling very tired now. Crushing. Yeah, the <laughs> adrenaline was keeping us going. Like, I realized I've literally not eaten anything today apart from a cookie. A cookie. 
but I felt fine for I hours. What the time is? What's the time? Like three o'clock or something? Yeah. Yeah, three. Can I have one? <laughs> no. There's like six. I don't know which there. one is what. We're saying, given the situation, I feel like I've not addressed it that much, but this is a moving whilst in lockdown kind of experience. Um, That's why we've done all the packing and lugging on our own. On our own, we've not made contact with anyone apart from really just a tiny bit when we went to pick up the keys. Like well, the lady she, put she it on the table. Put it on the table. And, and then she, she got it all there. She's yeah. like, there you go. And she smashed the um, door release button with her elbow. Oh, did oh, yeah. she? She was like, get out. Get out. <laughs> Stop contaminating yeah. my office. Take your keys and leave. Our new neighbour popped out though, outside their home, because they're right next to a semi-detached house and that was really sweet. Yeah. Kept our distance, but they were just saying hi. Mm. Yeah, we're going to Sainsbury's, but we're going to have to go in separately, you know, adhere to the social distancing rules and all that. So it's difficult. It's not that difficult, it's just awkward, isn't it's it? It's just awkward. Like, we can get the bare essentials, but then, like, nice stuff, like, sofa, an actual bed, TV. Yeah. Well, we can get a TV in a supermarket, but, like, actual furniture is going to be a bit more awkward to get, isn't it? Yeah, we're just going to have it all delivered. We've realised today is, like, how much we have to buy to yeah. live here. Like, we're sitting on a mattress. We must deal with fools I'm gonna play in this half hour. It's easy to set the door. That guy, you got him to live. We're home again. We did a massive shop just for, like, the kitchen essentials and a big food shop. Um, so I thought I'd just quickly show you what we got. Well, it's just sorting out all the food. We got everything from Sainsbury's. It was the only place open, really. That's the main reason, but yeah. Three pots. This nice stainless steel knife block. We got some <laughs> priorities. Just little champagne glasses, which are, or flutes, apparently the technical term. And um, we got some elegance wine glasses. And then this is where the majority of the stuff is that we got. A variation on my normal hauls, but this time it's a homework haul. So I got these cute little mason jars. I think they're really, really cute. You can just put anything in there, really. And these were on sale. I think they were only like three pounds each, so it wasn't too bad. It was definitely something I always imagined, like, when I have my own house, I want mason jars. So I got those. And um, got a little cheese grater. Scissors. Ooh, glass. Roasters is the right word. I won't show you everything because a lot of it is quite boring. It's just like normal cooking utensils and stuff. But here are all of the pans we got. Um, got some tea towels. The more plain the colour, the better, in my opinion, with tea towels. Some garden shears. Will apparently is going to be the gardener of the house. He's volunteered to. And then, oh, these are one of my favourite things we got. We got one bit of decor. And when I saw this, in the store, I was like, well, you have to go look. <laughs> I went and picked them up. I'm so happy. So it's definitely an inside joke. They're just two little, two little otters. But we both are obsessed with this channel. This guy who, I think he lives in Japan. Yeah, Japan. And he has two otters as pets. Cutest thing. So yeah, that's why we got those. So you guys, main appliances we got. So this one is um, our kettle. We got it from Russell Hobbs. And I've always wanted a clear kettle because I think it's just really cool. That's just my taste. And then we got this sexy looking toaster, again from Russell Hobbs. Oh, all three of them are from Russell Hobbs. I Hashtag realize. brand deal. Didn't even realize. So this is actually kind of blue. It's a midnight blue toaster, but it does look quite gray. So hopefully it'll look fine. Um, and then that's the microwave we went for it. So again, it's gray. Um, well, like stainless steel and it's a digital microwave, which we both were quite fussy about that we wanted a digital one. That's all we got for now. I think tomorrow we're going to order a sofa, um, potentially a bed. 20 past five. It feels a lot later. We're both starving, so probably going to look into getting some takeout soon. Oh, it's been such a mad day, but kind of feels like I'm in a dream. So weird. Tune in with you guys later. We have now set everything in the kitchen. This is what it's looking like. 
the toaster, the new kettle, these bits and bobs. It's obviously still a bit of a mess, but yeah, I love wait, this microwave. Very sexy. The living room is dreadful and we're trying to work out the Wi-Fi. This one just arrived. Take care out. We're tired, aren't we? Oh, I have to say cream crackers. <laughs> cream crackers. What a day. I can't remember what this is. More vegetables, sweet and sour chicken. Not one of my favorites. Good evening, guys. It is now one minute to 10. We are so tired, had our Chinese. And now we're actually doing some furniture shopping before we crash and sleep. But we're gonna try and measure this area because we maybe are gonna put a sofa there. But we need to see if the one that we have an eye on online is actually going to fit or not. Rebel. 